Welcome to Gooder 2019 and we've got another brand new car. This is the De Tommaso P72. Now we had heard that De Tommaso was coming back and we thought perhaps it would be a recreation of something like the Pantera GTS, that wonderful sort of iconic supercar shape really. But no, so this is taking inspiration from the P70. Alejandro De Tommaso, obviously eponymous founder of the company, had a project back in the 60s with Carol Shelby to create a sports car and that was the P70. It never saw the light of day for various reasons, um, mostly because he couldn't actually deliver on the, the seven litre engine that he'd promised. Anyway, that chassis went on, uh, it came from the Vallelunga, went on to become the Mangusta. It was never really finished, the P70, so this is a tribute to that. And it's pretty spectacular, I think it's rather beautiful. It reminds me of the Ferrari P45 that you might remember was done a few years ago as a, as a one-off on an Enzo, I think that was. It was a uh, Glickenhaus car. Inside, it's very bling. Reminiscent of a Pagani, I think, in there, but even more bling with all the, the rose gold and stuff. One thing we can notice about it is it just having manual gearbox, and I'm told that's not just for the show car, it will make it through to production as well. We don't know what engine it's going to have. I would be betting a V8 because that would link back to the original P70, but we don't know. We'll find out in due course. The engine this one's got on it is, in fact, from the Apollo IE. Why? Because this is based on the same chassis but I've been told that's a, it's a car monocoque, but it's got two pieces to it, and this is a different upper half to the Apollo IE, so it's not, it's not identical. Price? Well, it's going to be £662,000, and they're going to build just 72 of them. Let us know what you think. I think it's rather beautiful, apart from the rose gold. It's a bit over the top for me.